Welcome back, I'm Cardinal Direction, and it was pretty much unanimous for Delson to turn himself in. I think that might be a trend throughout the Let's Play, but I'm still going to leave future moral choices up to you. But enough about that, let's, uh, let's go to jail. I'm a conduit. What? I said, I'm a conduit, alright? I caught it a second ago from, from that guy. Oh, you caught it. Very funny. Ah! God! Telson! Ah! So, Betty. Maybe you can give me a straight answer. <laughs> yeah, I'm told that hurts. into a hospital? The DUP has just been brought in to clean it up. Ms. Augustine, How long have I been out? And of course, Brooke Augustine, head of the Department of Unified Protection. As the DOP lockdown of Seattle enters its second week now, there is still no sign of any progress. We will, of course, continue to follow the story and we'll have the very latest for you coming up. Nick, man, what the hell happened? Turn that damn thing off! People are sleeping! Did anyone do this? How many people did she hurt? And no one could stop her? Oh my god. Betty. Delson, dear. You're awake. So did Augustine do this to you? Yeah, why would you think I was gonna... Rat you out to that ornery trot. Besides, at the time, it seemed like all the cool kids were getting their legs pierced. So that means everyone here... We're a comish. We'd protect our own. No one here blames you for what happened. Yeah. Neither should you. Hey. Can't be ashamed for what you are. Can't help it. You were born that way. All that matters is I'm one of them now. You are not one of those beady-eyed bioterrorists who go around killing people higgly piggly. You're a good boy. Just happen to have smoke coming out of your fingers. That's the whole reason why we're in this is smoke coming out of my fingers. Hey. Don't go down that road. If you're gonna be such a buzzkill, I'm gonna have to go back to sleep because I need my rest so that I can get better and get on my feet again. And I can rest now because you're awake. You know, don't you worry. I'm gonna be fine. Really? Mm-hmm. Yes, sir. Man, 
Delson. Whoa. <sighs> Damn it. I thought we were going to lose you there. A little concrete in the legs? It's going to take more than that. Oh. Glad to see fast healing seems to be a part of your new uh, thing. Uh, speaking of which, um, the craziness with the hands, is that gone? Yeah, I don't know, man. There's no smoking in the longhouse, remember? <laughs> right. And I wouldn't want to get in the way of anyone's recovery. Recovery? Hey, Delson, these, these people aren't getting any better. They're dying, man. You don't know that. No, but the doctors who came through here when you were out, they do. And they said that... They said the only way those shards are coming out is the exact same way they went in. What? But that, that was Augustine and her concrete power. Yeah. And screw it, man. Looks like you and me are going to Seattle and we're gonna go get her. Whoa, 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 wait, what? You think you're just gonna charm her into coming back here with you? Come on, man, I know you took a bump to the head, but you two didn't exactly hit it off last time you were together. Reggie, I did this, and I gotta fix it. No, damn it, Dustin, you just got back on your feet. Look, I know you want to help, but the doctors have already said the only- The only way it's getting out is with the same power, I get it. Which means... We don't actually need Augustine. We just need her power. <laughs> okay, now you've lost me. I'm a goddamn power sponge, remember? If I got smoke, why can't I get concrete? <laughs> yeah, but what, what if smoke was just a fluke, huh? I mean, think about it, you'd have to go through, a, what, a thousand DUP guys just to get to her? Yeah, probably something like that. I'll explain in the truck. What truck? I don't have a truck, I... That's my truck. All right, I got this whole thing figured out, okay? We, we hit the town, we load up at the all-you-can-leech condo at Power Buffet, we maybe swing by the Space Needle, always wanted to see it, and then we're back home to save some lives. You do realize when we hit the town, there's a fair chance the town's gonna, you know, Head back. What does that even mean? It means that Seattle has half a million people that aren't exactly thrilled about the bioterrorists that are already there. You think they're gonna welcome you? No, but I'm gonna be different, okay? Oh, I'm okay. not there doing what they do. I'm there to save lives. I'm gonna be like Superman. I'll be yeah. healing the sick. The hero. What, you think they're gonna throw you a parade? Wake up, man. Look, don't worry, Dale. All right, we're gonna fix this thing. I'm gonna find you a cure. A cure? But shooting smoke out of your fingertips isn't exactly normal, man. Just because it's not normal doesn't mean that it needs a cure, okay? Van Gogh wasn't normal. Gandhi wasn't normal. Yeah, but people weren't scared of Gandhi, all right? People are afraid of bioterrorists. They're freaks. See, that's pre-programmed bull... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Shit. Great. Huh. Well, looks like we're walking the rest of the way. <laughs> Walk? What? Yeah. Where are you going? Hey! Damn it. Holy crap, would you look at this. Uh, look, you know, if you're having second thoughts, I completely... Are you kidding me? This is amazing! <laughs> This is destruction. This is self-defense, man. The roadblock was set up to attack them. Yeah, because they're bioterrorists. Well, it didn't stop them, and it's not gonna stop this bad boy either. Man, this is like a post of oh, This must be the mothership. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, Delson! Hey, are you okay? Okay? I'm better than okay, man. I think I picked up a new trick. Yep. <laughs> oh, God. yeah. De 
definitely new and improved. Jelson, this is not improved, man. We're trying to fix the problems you already have, not add new ones. What do you think? Augustine is just sitting on her ass? I gotta power up if I'm gonna go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Concrete Queen. Hey, I'm hoping to avoid that. Listen, there might be another way that we can get to Augustine. What other way? I, what other I way? I have a few connections in Seattle. All right, some in the police force. No, if no, we no, get no, no, no. This is not the point where Reggie swoops in and makes everything all right. That's this it. is not your problem to fix. It is mine. Oh, is somebody there? Can you hear me? There. Perfect. You want to go help somebody? Go save damsel in distress. Anyone? It's not. Please? All right, fine. We both go. Come oh, on. no, 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 no. You I go need... play super cop, okay? I will catch up with you in a minute. All right, but don't go anywhere. And for God's sake, don't touch anything! I'm gonna touch everything. Hello. You're up first, little guy. This is our introduction to Blast Shards. They function identically to how they did in the past games. Ordinarily, you can use them to replenish your smoke meter, but after the game decided to take away our ammunition, I think they want us to use the car or like an oh, actual source okay, of smoke. Yeah, so if you see something time. like that, a blast shard or a smokestack, odds are you can absorb smoke from it and replenish your health and your ammunition. Yeah, this should do the trick. Ooh. Man, once we hit this city, I'm gonna have to keep an eye out for more of those things. I need you up here. Dude, you will not believe what that beeping was. Let's get up I... here, okay? I found a bus full of relief workers that's stuck. I'm trying to convince them to just abandon the bus. They don't want to leave all the medical supplies on top. Well, just tell them to hold on. I'll get the bus unstuck. Nelson, I know what you're thinking, and don't. Dude, I just took out a fleet of quadcopters. I think I can dig out a bus. Like the previous games, once we collect enough blast shards, we'll be able to upgrade our powers, our ability, our smoke meter. Um, this is a bit of a hand-holdy tutorial though, so they definitely want you to try and plink away at these dumb slabs before you get what you want. The Cinder Blast is really helpful, and it's really, really fun to use, I think. If you're surrounded by enemies, uh, you like getting up in their face, it's a great option to either get out of a bad situation or just to, you know, send someone flying. Delson, I'm not- Ah, lost you. Just to hit the mute button. Okay, looks like the rest of the way is clear. I'm gonna ride this baby straight into Seattle. Dude, ready, open up, let's go. Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. Delson, we got a problem. Some of the people on the bus, they saw you doing your super thingy to clear the way. And? And they're afraid of you. What? Look, I told you, man. Bioterrorists aren't especially popular. This is one of my, like, Rosa Parks, and they want me to sit on the back of the bus? No, they want you to sit outside the bus. Look, they don't want you in here, right? They said if you come on, they're gonna get off. Then let them walk. I don't care. You think I can't take this door down? You are not gonna do that. These people have never seen anything like you before, and they're scared, right? And I can't blame them. He says he's gonna break down the door. Go! Oh, sir! Just give me a second! Look, just let me run them across the bridge. I'll come right back for you, all right? It'll take five minutes. Come on, man. I can't let you on the bus. Five minutes. Listen, just 
switch on the GPS tracking on your phone in case we get separated. Oh, you mean like right now? Speaking of Delson's phone, you might have noticed that his ringtone is actually the uh, theme to Sly Cooper, so that's kind of cute. Attention. The scheduled decommission of the 520 bridge by order of the DUP will begin shortly. All vehicles and individuals are ordered to... Huh, that sounds like useful information. Delson, I got the aid workers across the DUP. Clearing the bridge. Coming back for you, so... Are you there? What's going on? Hello? Hey! Hey! You guys need any help? Oh, shit. A bioterrorist. Hey! Hey! It's one of those it's freaks! It's okay. Whoa! No, 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 no! <laughs> oh, this fast healing stuff is gonna come in real handy. This is what combat's gonna look like for the most part. You won't be hey, able to sneak up on many I enemies though. And that's not really gonna matter because the fun of combat is getting into these really chaotic situations and just getting out of them and jumping back in really stylishly. Because Delson just feels really strong, especially compared to Cole. And I feel like Cole is a bit... Okay, okay, I'll give up, okay? Feel like paper, really. So, since you guys chose good at first, we're gonna we're subdue enemies for good karma for now. I don't think it would make much sense to hold a separate vote for each and every enemy. Oh, this is gonna suck. <laughs> what the? Reggie? Oh man, answer me! Oh my god. This was a bridge? So this is an awesome section, I think, to acquaint the player with all of their well, Corey, movement hey, options. So we're going to be getting a lot of new abilities that center around jumping and flying, and that's awesome. Another shot. Okay, Cosmos, keep them coming. Some are a little more situational than others, such as this one, but for <laughs> okay. now it's going to be helpful. It is definitely the least useful move that we're going to be getting here, though. Hovering is going to be a big part of the game for pretty much the whole thing. Reggie? Delson, what's this I hear about you and your brother taking off for Seattle? It's really not a good time, Betty. Okay, you just be careful and have fun. Okay, I will. Bye. Hold still. I mean, you can already see how useful it is. So, when you can hover around, fly, take huge jumps, Mashing that together with a fight makes everything just really engaging. And you can get a lot of distance out of jumping off of a car yeah, using the smoke dash and then hovering. Break. I mean, obviously, but still.
boss. Reggie! Reggie! So, despite how ridiculous all of that just was, um, I have a bit of an issue with this bit. Because if you'll look closely at Reggie, like, you'll notice that his feet are already in the water. To be honest, I'm not really sure what the danger here even is. Delson! Alright, 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 come on. I got it. Thanks for the hand. Check it out. Wow. You seem to be getting the hang of your, uh, new symptoms, right? <laughs> of course, the only downside being that, uh, Nope, can't think of anything. This is pretty freaking awesome. <laughs> really? No downside? How about those heavily armed guys over there now want to hurt you real bad? That a downside? Yeah. Now look, for all we know, we may be able to pass you through their security, you know, because you're not a normal viral terrorist. So normal? You know. No, no, if you mean by normal, you know, the sheep that they try to line up so that they can probe them. No, Reggie, I'm not normal. And did you see what I did on that bridge? We I can did. take these look, guys. Let's just see if we can sneak you through their checkpoints first, all right? It'll make getting around the city a lot easier. Okay, fine, fine. We'll do it your way. I'll settle. Listen, promise me you'll play it cool up ahead. Hey, they used to call me Mr. Cool. No one has ever once called you that. Ever. Are you really worried about this? Look, these DUP guys may not have the same level of power that you... that natural bioterrorists have, but the government infused them all with enough to still do some serious damage. Well, you have just officially ruined my Seattle vacation. How long did you say I was out for? One week. Wow. That means the DUP put all of this up to... Yep. Oh, they've kept busy. Once we're through, I'll check with a couple of my cop buddies and try and get access to the police databases. In the meantime, I need you to just lay low. I might spook him if I show up with a bioterrorist. Okay, boss man. This is a registered firearm. I'm a police officer. Of course. Hey, he won't let me on his bus, won't let me meet his friends. The basic combat doesn't really change all that much, well for now, but um, if you blow up those substations, um, you can get a new blast shard, so it's definitely in your interest to do that. The one unfortunate thing I can say about Second Son is that there's not a whole lot of enemy variety. For the most part, we're seeing the enemies we're going to be seeing, you know, 10 hours from now. Once you've killed enough, or subdued enough, I should say, you have the option of finding the stragglers and either executing them or subduing them as well. Just like you said, laying low. Just keep laying low. I'll call when I've got something. We didn't run into any wounded civilians, but we'll be seeing a lot of them. And it, it just makes me wonder why the city of Seattle is okay with this. But now that we're in the city proper, and we have a big area to run around no, no, in, we can definitely peace. see 
how quickly we can get around, especially compared to Infamous 1. The smoke dash combined with the hovering and the vents is fantastic. It lets you get everywhere super quickly. And that's only going to get faster. So Second Sun really nails transportation. But next time, we're going to hop down there and uh, show those DUP soldiers what for.